closer because this is a serious thing. Let me ask, so where are you from? Trinidad, where you say, brother, where are you from again? So you see the confusion already? You guys don't know who you are according to the Bible. You don't know that you're an Israelite. First give me Deuteronomy 7 and 6. Because you two were, were, are the same people. But why are you saying from Trinidad and you're from um, uh, uh, let's say Vincent? That's just two different slave boats you're brought, uh, slave lands you're brought to. Right? But where are you guys before that? Read this. This is the book of Deuteronomy chapter 7 verse 6. Okay. For the art and holy people. So listen, brother. What is it, what is it Andrew? What was your name again? So, okay, talk louder. You're a man, talk louder. Andrew. Daniel. Daniel. See, I can't hear you. It says, what's your name? Katie. So Daniel and what? Katie. Katie. Understand, do you know you're a special people on in, on this earth? Right. Did you know that? You're not, you're not just black. Right, right. You're special. Right. You guys need to hear this thing and learn this. Read. Bring it out. For thou art an holy people. Holy means separate. We're separate right. from everybody else. Look how everybody wants to follow us. Act like us. Be like us. But they don't understand that we're God's chosen people. Right, right, right. But yeah, you guys don't know you're God's chosen people. Did you know that? I'm asking you, did you know that? You didn't know that before. But today you're going to learn this. Read. Unto the Lord thy God. Remember, so God, listen, brother. God has separated us from the nations for himself. Come close. Right. Don't be scared, man. Because too long, listen. This is information you're not going to hear from church. Right. You're not going to hear this from your parents. Right. right. No, most has put his spirit on us to teach you guys. That's so right. give us the time and just learn. Right. Just, just learn and hear us out, all right? Read that. The Lord thy God hath chosen thee okay. to be a special people. Let's see how special you guys are. Read on. Unto himself. Unto who? Unto himself. So out of all the nations, the most High chose us to be special unto himself. I'm not saying this. The Bible saying this. Read. Above all people. You listening? Above what? Above all people. Daniel. So are you beneath? Are you beneath the nations? Or are you above all people? You, you're sitting. You say loud. You're what? Sis. Are you beneath? Or are you above? So we have to start acting like it. That's right. That's right. We have to start acting like it. Teach. Like, we don't know who we are. Right. You, are you guys a couple? Or are you guys just friends? Okay. Okay. But understand this. We, let's just read this. Above. Read. Above all people. Sis, you hear it? You know you're you know you're above all people. God has chosen us to be above all. Did you know that? That's what we're teaching our people here. Right. So read up from the top, because you just came in. You guys don't mind me explaining it to her. Sis, we're gonna read it again so you can understand what we're talking about. We're trying to show that we are the Israelites and we're above all nations. God has chosen us. Read. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7, verse 6. You guys gotta go, it is what it is, but this word is more important. Read. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy God. Uh -huh. The Lord thy God hath chosen thee. So, sis, the Lord thy God has chosen thee, you, read on. To be a special people uh -huh. unto himself. A special people unto himself. So, so, that right there shows we're above all nations. Read right. on, let's finish this. Above all people. Above that uh, who? Above all people. No, some people. Above all people. The Bible says the Israelites, the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans are above all people. Right. Right. The Jamaicans, the Trinidadians, right. the West Indies, right. the, the Hispanics, the, the, we are above all people. Right. Right. Read. Above all people that are upon the face of the earth. So, sis, that's a good thing. You should be rejoicing in here in that way. Right. I'm special. God has chosen me and my nation above everybody else. Right. But the next question is, how are we supposed to conduct ourselves? Huh? How are we supposed to move? What what special things are we supposed to follow? Because if we're special, should we be um, dibbling and dabbling in Christmas? Yeah. New Year's? Birthdays? God has given us a special high holy day. Right. These things are supposed to be indulging in. Right. Rejoicing in. Is it more on this? Give me Exodus 22. So, what do you know about the Bible? Like, I want to interact. First, let me ask, what's your name? We're talking to me louder, Ethan. Tamara. I said it right? Tamara. My name is Soldier Zachariah. So we're trying to show our people that we are God's chosen people. I don't know if you you never heard this from any pastor before. Why? Because they're full of lies. They just want to steal your money right. and keep you in the bottom. Right. They're in cahoots with the white man to keep us as slaves. So we're going to give you the understanding of the Sabbath day. This is one day you can keep to be special. 28. This is the book of Exodus chapter 20 verse 8. Yeah, when you lie on the 
the Sabbath day to keep it holy. So just like how God said we're holy, we have a special separated day to keep as well. That's the Sabbath day. But key word, it says remember, because we're going to forget. We went through slavery and we forgot to keep the Sabbath day. Now, read. Six days shalt thou labor and do all thy work. So six days. Let me ask you, what's the seventh day of the week? See, uh, see this? Saturday is the seventh day of the week. Not Sunday, but Saturday. So let's see what we're supposed to be doing on the Sabbath day. Read that part again. Six days shalt thou labor and do all thy work. The Most High give us all six days to labor and work on. But, this, but what? But the seventh day is the Sabbath of the Lord thy God. The seventh day is the Sabbath day. It's a separate day. Good. Not every day, but the Sabbath day is the separate day from that's holy unto us. Read Good. on. And it thou shalt not do any work. Moses, you didn't know from before, but now you're on the hook. Now you know you shouldn't be working on the Sabbath day. We understand we were in captivity, but we have to stand up for God's laws. So you know what? I'm taking back my heritage. Because that's what this Bible is, you know. The Bible's our heritage book. Did you know that? It's our history book. Right. Moses is a black man. Right. Adam is a black man. Right. Eve is a black woman. Right. Mother Mary is a black woman. Right. You understand? The Most High God is a black man according to the Bible. Right. Right. And we're tired of being lied to. That's right. what we're teaching. Read. Thou nor thy sons nor thy daughters. Read on. Thy manservant nor thy maidservant. So understand, we are not supposed to be breaking God's Sabbath. Right. He gave us this day to go and rest. Right. Relax. Congregate. Celebrate. Enjoy ourselves. What is the nation? Nation is men leading by example.